Boys and girls, this is your music teacher, Dr. Madison. And today we're going to do Frog Day. You know, in the past we have done Spider Day and Elephant Day. Today is Frog Day and all of our activities will have to do with frogs. We're going to do a listening activity with me here on this channel. And then below there are three links for you to see. One is a read aloud book called I Don't Want to Be a Frog. The second is the song Five Little Speckled Frogs, and I will go over the motions for that with you in a moment. And then finally, there is a Tinker Tales on why the frog croaks. So our first activity is a listening activity called Frogs and Worms. So I want you to take one hand and decide that that is your frog hand, and then the other hand would be your worm hand. Whenever you hear the frog music, your frog hand is going to jump up and down. And whenever you hear the worm music, your worm hand is going to wiggle back and forth. We have frogs and we have worms. Why don't we try that together? This is a silent activity, so we're listening for the music and just moving our bodies. Number 11, frogs and worms. That sounds like a worm to me. That's definitely a frog, isn't it? Oh, they surprise me. Oh, they changed it. I think it's over. Boys and girls, we're going to be looking at the song Five Little Speckled Frogs. Frogs and Worms. Sorry about that. We're going to be looking at the song Five Little Speckled Frogs. So you have five fingers, five little speckled frogs. Sat on a speckled log, eating some most delicious bugs. And then you shout, yum, yum. One jumped into the pool, where it was nice and cool. Then there were four green speckled frogs. And frogs live in the water, so they make this sound. Glub, glub. Here's the motions. The number of frogs on the log jump into the pool where it was very cool, and then we make that great sound, glub, glub. The links for the videos are in the description of this. Have a great and super fantastic frog day.